Yes, yes, it's been a while. Everyone knows. Ah, where was I? Ah, yes. Two unlikely versions of one impossible story. The Hyperion salaryman who stumbled across the perfect plan to defeat his rival. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Hijacking the secret purchase of the ultimate prize, a vault key. Finding co-conspirators was easy. Finding real vault keys never is. Then there's the Pandoran Hustler, who conspired to sell a fake vault key. But unfortunately, plans don't often go, you know, as planned. A bullet saved is a bullet earned. And now, they were stuck with each other, with nothing to gamble but their lives. So? They prepared to face psychos, warlords, even vault hunters. For betrayal, no one is prepared for betrayal. He didn't think she would shoot, but she did. The money was gone, but the path to a vault key was right under their feet. Below the arena, they found the Gortis Project, Atlas's crown jewel, along with a lost king, looking to regain his throne. I'm up. Hey! I'm up. Seriously, can you use your words? <sighs> You're just wasting bullets with that thing. Mm, yeah, okay. Ah, oh, come on, you drooled on me! Huh? Oh, yeah, that's a. Wow, that's a lot. I am feeling a little dehydrated. <laughs> what is wrong with you? There. Now we're even. You are a monster! Stop! I'm gonna let you out of those restraints. Don't make me regret it, because you regret it much more. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah, okay. Yeah, we, that works for me. Let's do that. We've got a long way to go. We should move before the sun's up. Uh, can I please hit him once? Just to get it out of my system. You gotta work on your anger management. All this animosity is not good for- Just one. What? <laughs> okay, I'm good. Uh, he punched me in the neck. Let's go. Now where were we? Well... <laughs> what is it? Reese, buddy, you uh, you all right? Hey, Reese, what is your problem? He gets uh, headaches sometimes. Uh, probably just a glitch in his wiring. He's all right. He, you know, just probably needs some air. So, uh, upstairs where there's more air because it's higher. And hey, what's up with that map? Computer enhance. I don't think it can hear you. Oh, that's what it wants us to think. You hear me, machine? I'm on to you. In 
Enhance. Enhance computer images. Stop it. This is not how computers work. Where are you from? You, you don't just yell enhance at the screen. Maybe I can bring up a legend on this thing. Ah! I'm okay. Did you break it? Go ahead, Fiona. Uh, pick it up. Hey, Fee, trust me. You don't want to touch that. I don't understand. You and Reese are the only ones that didn't shock. Maybe they're somehow imprinted on you. Vintage Atlas. Uh, incredible! Retinal scanner online. Security protocol engaged. Retinal scan required. Please step forward and identify yourself. Uh, maybe we should get out while we have the chance. That map could lead us to a vault. We're not leaving until we know exactly where it's telling us to go. Please step forward and identify yourself. Guess I should have known it'd go like this. What's taking so long? Retinal scan failed. Employee not recognized. Alerting General Pollux. Oh, craps. That's probably not... Wait. You hear that? Sosh, cover me while I take a look. Atlas could have booby-trapped the whole place. Got it. Okay, yeah, that's exactly what I thought I was going to see. Well, now all we have to do is get his eye to that retinal scanner. Oh, maybe we can just scoot him over to the computer. wedged in there pretty tight. Now what? Well, it's a retina scanner, right? We don't actually need all of him for that. Ooh, how much he got? Not that much. Now you'd think a general would have more walking around money on him. Look at his uniform. Atlas military, high ranking at that. If you try to rip it out with your bare hand, you'll just end up squishing it. Uh, if you have a better idea... Any other idea would be a better idea! His eyes are... Pretty creepy. You're basically doing him a favor. I'm not sure he would agree.
Oh, hey, it's a spoon and a fork. Ha! How about that? Oh, wait, that's not... Yep. The eye's gotta come out one way or another. Okay, this is... Okay. Yeah, yeah, you, you gotta do it. I, I gotta do it. I gotta do it, so I just... Just... Shove that into his face. Why do you have to say it like that? I'm just saying. Did you just do it already? Okay. <laughs> Why did that just happen? Oh, man. You split the eye right in half. All the juice from the thing. Ugh. Why are you describing it to me? I know. I did it. Right. Sorry. Look, all I'm saying is, you got one more shot. Right, because he's got two eyes. One eye, now. You've got a knack for numbers, don't you? I'll just wait over there. Here we go. Right, so far so good. Stop talking to me. Ooh. I can't tell if that's looking better or looking worse. It's looking way worse. Trust me. If you're gonna puke, do it on the floor, please. This is me helping. Ooh! Ugh! You almost... you almost got it. Just... cut the thing. I'm holding it to the... the thing. Whoa! Look I got it! I got it! Thank you. Hey! And you didn't crush it. I totally would have crushed it. Let's just get this thing over to the scanner. Message one. Athena. Gortis facility. Old Haven. Hello, Pollux. Too bad I missed you in Old Haven. As you've no doubt surmised, the Gordis project has been terminated. And now that you have no soldiers under your command, I regret to inform you that you've been relieved of your duties. I'll come by soon to ease your transition into retirement. Uh, what's Old Haven? It's an Atlas mining town. It's been abandoned for years. Which makes it the perfect place to hide a Gordis project. Whatever that is. Message to General Pollux Memorandum. If you're watching this, then I'm already in suspended animation. You must understand, Athena was trying to kill me, and what I possess is far too powerful to end up in the arsenal of a ruthless mercenary. But Athena is no longer a threat. Please activate the revival protocol in my stasis dock. My life and quite possibly the fate of the universe is in your hands. Oh, no. Does that mean he was... Oh, when you scooped... Oh! Ah. No way. No. No, he had to be dead when we... <sighs> don't. Just... Don't. So, I guess we're going to Old Haven. Reese, you want to take a look at... <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. I'm fine. What's the matter with you? I'm fine. Be right down. Oh! Wait, what? I didn't hit my head. What are you talking about? I saw you hit that girder. No, no, no. no. I, I, I hit my head on that, but I didn't hit my head when I fell into the computers. And obviously there wasn't a geyser of blood. There was quite a bit of blood. This is all fascinating, Mary. Thorough. But what about Jack? Oh, right. Jack. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the Gordis Project. And it's gonna lead us to a vault. 
And then I'll probably kill you. <laughs> what? Okay. Here's what's gonna happen. You, uh... I'm sorry. What's your name again? Come on. Spit it out, dum-dum. I don't have all day. Oh, good. You work for me. I thought... I thought I was gonna have to get violent there for a second. Or more violent. Come on! Time's a waste. Turrets, no lot of defenses. <laughs> it's like Atlas is just begging us to take it. Come on, Cupcake, what's the holdup? Get out of here! Yeah, I know, I'm your hero, you're my biggest fan, blah blah blah. Welcome to the club. Just try not to wipe yourself. You might short something like that. Alright, take notes, kiddo. I'm not one to repeat myself. Our first step is secure the area. Uh, not enough to attract bandits, just enough to keep out the gawkers. Oh, uh, then we're gonna need a drop ship to get this tech out of here. Jack, what? Well, this is impossible. Jack, you're... You're dead! Uh, I'm dead? I'm sorry, what's that supposed to mean? Are you threatening me, little man? Huh? No, 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 no! Why did that just happen? Um, oh, shut up! Are you screaming because you're in pain, or are you just freaking out because this is really weird? Because it is, it is weird. Please don't kill me. I'm trying to help. This, this, this doesn't make any sense. Stand still, damn it! Stop doing that! It's like I told you. Handsome Jack? Is dead. No, 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 no. That's impossible. I, I can't die. It's the, no, no, that's no, stupid. No way. Oof. Never had to tell someone they died before. So, uh, sorry. That must suck. Uh, heroes don't die, <laughs> uh, especially not before the story gets to the good part. This doesn't make any sense. No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm handsome Jack. <laughs> I don't die. Hey, there's too much left to do. I'm not, not having it. Not happening. Hey, come here, Cupcake. Just let me try to rip your throat out one more time. Just one more time. Come here. What? No, no. Ah, uh, you see, I think I just gotta be quicker about it. That's what it is. Stand still, damn it. Don't make this harder on yourself. Come here. Hey, hey, come on, stop it. You're just wasting your time. Oh, I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> You're so stupid. Watch your head, David. What's the matter with you? Oh! Reese! So much pain. Why am I still conscious? I don't understand. Reese, hey. You alright? What the hell are you doing? You're acting... strange. I... I know that sounds weird, but... I just... I just saw Handsome Jack. What are you saying? Handsome Jack, he was... he was next to me. Right! Okay, well you had quite a spill there. Let's just get you up off this thing. Here you go. You know, these fumes can't possibly be helping. Oh, I must be pretty out of it. Seeing stars. Shooting stars. Moonshots. Moonshots? Really? Moonshots? We need to get out of here! The Loaderbot! Loaderbot, hey! Thanks. Get in! We gotta go!
Please, don't you work for those guys? I'll file a complaint with HR when we get back. But we have to not die right now! We used up our boost getting out of there! How long till it recharges? A few minutes, at least. Give me the wheel. What? Why? Uh, I'm not hearing a good reason. That's what I thought. I can dodge the moonshots. That's impossible. Not if I know where they're gonna land. Then what? We'll go to Hollow Point. They can't track us there. You better know what you're doing. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Just keep us alive until that thing is full and then we can boost out of here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I don't got it!
The list of things that might kill us keeps getting longer. I hadn't even thought about moonshots. Racks, skags, bandits, dehydration, heat stroke, regular stroke, stroke stroke. Whatever that is. That murder pile. The list just keeps getting longer. I've never felt so alive! <laughs> this is awesome! I can't imagine going back to financial reports. Ugh! Boring. That's the spirit, buddy. It's just... I know it's weird to say, but I'm having a great time. Vaughn, I feel the same way. This! This is what I'm talking about! Mixing it up with Hyperion, teaming up with grifters? Come on, these are the types of stories we'll tell our children when we're millionaires! We just survived moonshots from Hyperion, huh? Friggin' moonshots, man! I am not afraid anymore! You hear me, Hyperion? I am Vaughn, and I am not afraid! Yo, what the hell was that? Relax, it's a vet. Oh, okay. I have to pee. And not because I was scared. I, I had to go anyway. This is perfect timing. Reese, you're alive. <sighs> Thank God you guys are okay. I thought that was it for a second there. I am so relieved. So... Thanks for the warning. Trust me, I tried. I did. Tell her to send some supplies! Yeah, don't talk to me while you're peeing. Thank you. Sorry! Almost done! Anyway, I got them to stop shooting, but I can't keep Vasquez from wanting to take you guys out. I'm doing what I can, but it's chaos up here. So I can't talk long. Hey, Yvette, are you able to locate Loaderbot? We kinda lost him racing away from the moonshots. I'm not picking up a signal just yet. Look, I'm able to track you, so stay safe for now. I'll send what I can. Cool. Hopefully she can help us out. We can't be walking through the desert too long. I mean, not without water. To go through all this and die of dehydration would be pretty lame. Uh, fun? Did you get stung by bees? What? Why? What's happening? Cause you're looking all swole. Huh? Swollen. Sw sw I, swole is short for swollen. You are weirdly buff, dude. That's what I'm... I put an exercise bike in my office a few months ago. Don't worry about it. Right. He is pretty young. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm a little envious of the definition he's got going. He's saving the world. It doesn't leave you much time for the gym. I mean, I've got muscles where it matters, sure. But, uh... Damn, I could never get that tone. Where, uh... Where did you go? Well, that's what I've been quietly contemplating. As I take in the desert air, and wonder what kind of training regimen your friend is on. Reese, who are you talking to? So he definitely can't see me, right? You're kind of freaking me out, Reese. We're the only ones hey, here. Hey, Reese, buddy. There's no way this guy's gonna believe. You have been hitting your head a lot lately. I mean, I barely believe this crap, and I'm in the middle... It's nothing. I'm just... Thinking out loud. Okay. He definitely thinks you're crazy. <laughs> I'm not crazy. <laughs> what? No! No! Who said anything about crazy? <laughs> uh, I did. So, let's find some shade. The vet can track us for the drop. Yeah, I don't know what state of being uh, I'm in right now, but, uh, well, walking still sucks. What, what did I do to deserve this? Seriously. It, it, don't, don't look at me like that. Hey. Oh, oh, you're ignoring me. That's uh, that's what you're doing. Okay. Oh, come on! So, what do you think of the girls? Hopefully they're all right. Oh, I like them a lot. Oh, Reese, you're my hero. I'm just so excited to be on this adventure. With you. Hey, why are you looking down there? 
Having a tough time ignoring that. All right, yeah. <laughs> do, do you get it? It's like his wiener's talking. <laughs> it's comedy goal. You're creeping me out. <laughs> I can't handle it. Uh. <laughs> it's nothing. <laughs> oh, come on, Reese. I know it's not much, but it is something. <laughs> All right, let's just forget about that you're looking down there forever. It's probably for the best. It's about time. Thank you. So, I guess she's sending a new loader bot. Uh-oh! Incoming! <laughs> it's coming right for us. Hey, I guess that tracker's working, huh, boys? It's coming <laughs> right for us! Go to Baba! I suck. Fancy meeting you two here. Here I was, out for a nice drive, and I land right on just the guys I was looking for. How did you find us, Hugo? Ho ho ho! <laughs> You're Hyperion property, Reese. Hyperion doesn't lose track of its property. Look, I know we had a deal. And uh, while I don't like to go back on an agreement made man to man, the circumstances of... Hey, that's I right! We did have a deal! You convinced me to double-cross my best friend, and the day isn't even over before you're double-crossing me? Oh, <laughs> oh man. When you put it like that, it does sound awful. Wow, man. Just... Wow. Should've known better than to trust a snake like you. Oh, don't be like that, little guy. It's just the way of the, uh... Listen, I'm gonna go see if I got a shirt in the trunk, because your body is making me uncomfortable. Hold tight, kids. Look, I told him I would sell you out, but I swear I wasn't going to do it. I was just saying whatever he wanted to hear just to keep that jerk off our backs. I wasn't going to follow through with it. Please believe me. I swear, Reese. I would never. We will talk about this later. Okay. Okay, that works. I guess I just... What's that? There, shovels, genius. You two freaks start digging. I want to see a decent grave going before too long. You heard me. Don't make me tell you again. <laughs> Let's work this out. We're way, way past that. Uh, you, you, me, you and me, we, uh, we could partner Partners, up. Partners, huh? Oh, who knew you had such a flair for comedy? You should take that act on the road. Oh, wait. No, you're going to be dead in five minutes. What part of Dig don't you understand? Let's get going, Mr. Universe! Okay, just don't shoot! There you go! A little hard work never killed anybody. I mean, you're gonna die. Yeah, sure, but I mean, it won't be the... Dig faster. Time is money, Reese. Really? You want me to dig my own grave faster? <laughs> <Reese>! <laughs> oh. 
Oh. Ah. Damn. Damn, that smarts. I think I did that wrong. I... You got a tough noggin. Looks so easy in the movies, but... Amateur hour. You gotta aim for the bridge of the nose, dum-dum. How is it every time I show up, you idiots are in a worse situation? <laughs> You're not helping. <sighs> All right, fun's over. Looks like we'll be settling for the shallow variety of grave. Reese, you die first, and then he can load your body in the car. I'll bury Vaughn myself. What? Yeah, they want this idiot's body for something up there. Something, uh, important floating around in his head. This is a prototype. The most advanced gun Hyperion has ever made. Someone's overcompensating. Any... last words? Before the... What is it? The inevitable... End of cast. Two. Eat. Shit. Yeah, there's the spirit. Well, that was three words, but I'll be sure to put eight shit on your tombstone. And I'd be more worried about my tombstone if you knew where the safety was. You're hilarious. I'm gonna miss your... Gosh damn it. Uh, is there a problem? I know how to shoot a gun! I just want to get the maximum damage out of this thing. Okay, look, as much as I'd love to watch this idiot kill you two idiots, I can't let that happen. I'm, I'm inside of... I'm not inside you, but I'm like, look, if you go, I go. I've enhanced your Echo Eye, so use it to hack something and get us the hell out of this jam. Figure out how you can pay me back later. I've got you back. Right. Okay, mess this guy up. Heavy, but it's solid piece of metal. This is Push this in. Push this in, and nothing's happening. Something feels locked. Where's that? Safety on this. Where's safety? Huh. Right. What the hell's going on? Okay, we got power. Check. What are you doing with your hands? Uh, I'm, I'm not doing that. Oh, hello. <laughs> this is an interesting little development. Pine, look, we gotta go! This... is my head! Get out! Ah, oh, come on, don't be like that. Oh, oh you see, you see what you did? You hit your... Freeze! Yeah, go ahead and run! You're just making this butter for me. I mean, they know where we're going! Maybe we should just meet them there! Well, I guess we could just meet them in Old Haven, and get a head start, or we could always just go to Hollow Point, though that might be dangerous. Man, this is a big decision! <laughs> it's weird, but I, I always, uh, you know, talk to myself during, you know, huge choices. It's just something I do and I, I know it's just, you know, super important. I, I'm not talking 
to you. I'm, I'm talking to me right now, so... Anywho, probably should just choose something. Well, that's probably enough out of me. at Hollow Point. Then we'll go together. Like a family. Sounds good. To Hollow Point. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. It was just to keep Vasquez off of us. Like I said, I would never betray you, bro. Do you forgive me? Just say yes, because I feel like super bad right now, bro. It's good, bro. Really? Yeah, bro, don't sweat it. We're good. Oh, bro, thanks, bro. No problem, bro, bro. Thanks, bro. Hey, we're bros, bro. That's bro, bro. Bro! Bro, 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 bro. Bro, 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 Are you done? Bro, 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 bro. Unbelievable! I got one. We should probably let him finish. Fine. I'm curious. Why would you choose to go to Hollow Point? What was there to gain? I'm growing impatient. Well, despite what you might call a lack of skill, I've moved up through the ranks at Hyperion fairly quickly. Straight to the middle. And I've been able to do that because of one thing. And one thing only. Loyalty. As evidenced by your former boss trying to kill you. We all have our reasons. I suppose yours are good enough. If they were, we wouldn't be here. A man can only take so much. Luckily, you're a safe distance from a man. <laughs> we were stranded in the desert. You had a car. Did you even consider coming to get us? We had our own... One of you will have to change a tire. They're practically a graveyard. I hate to say it, but they're not gonna last the night. Yeah, that's what I kind of thought. Between the exposure, the skags, and the psychos, I'd say they're screwed. They knew what they signed up for. With a caravan like this, we couldn't help them if we wanted to. Exactly rolling in cash right now. How are you gonna get him to do it? I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. Oh, please. This is me doing this. Nothing I can't handle. Okay, don't get too cocky. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. <laughs> 
Wouldn't have it any other way. Scooter must have connections at Dalcorp. Leaving me out like this. I almost feel sorry for the poor sap. Almost. Alright, carry the three to five by twelve. Ah, oh, what the hell, man? I gotta cut down my wrench budget. Oh, oh hey, man! Welcome to Scooter's Catch a Ride! What can we do for you today? Uh... Sorry if I seem a little dis distracted. Uh, hopefully handing this place over to the new proprietor today and I gotta get all these numbers and stuff in order. No, it's a lot. I don't know if you know this, but the transition from small business owner to franchise owner is surprisingly difficult. Haven't seen this much paperwork since my aunt cousin tried to marry my brother, uncle, and she sued. Wow, this is a really nice looking place you have here, Scooter. Oh, thanks, man. It means a lot. Business has been a little slow so far, you know, being in a hidden cave town and everything, but it'll pick up. <laughs> Hope it picks up, though. Holy crap! I knew I recognized this rig from somewhere. You were in the latest Boston Over Death Rally! Oh, I was there, man! Did you see me? I was I was waving! You were a badass! You watched the latest Boston Over Arena Death Race thing? Winner. Badass. That thing's beat up to hell and back, man. I can fix it, but it's probably gonna run you about 2,500 cold. 2,500? Uh, that's a little out of my price range. Not to be implied or nothing. But you must have won a buttload of money from that race, right? Where did it all go? Oh, cause my cousin, right? He said that his sister's friend's neighbor's husband won one of them races one time and the cats kept them fed for weeks. Of course, those days they were mostly, you, you know, the, the money. But, but still, it was weeks. Yeah, someone stole it. Can you believe that? Yes, actually. Yes, I can. Well, tell me this. You think you could ever see yourself racing again? Let me pitch you something, and it might be crazy. But if you keep racing, I would love to endorse you as a sponsor. What do you say? It'll be great. Maybe like a billboard, a couple commercials, product placement. You'd be huge. Scooter, sir, you have yourself a deal. Yeah? Oh man, this is awesome! You will not regret this, no way, no how, man! But, uh, say it once for me, man, you know? The catchphrase? Catch a ride! You know what? Come on. Don't be shy, I'm your sponsor now! Gotta hear how you do the catchphrase! Go on, do it! Catch a Catch a ride! Hee <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking that we put a big old ad on your van, you know, like maybe a picture of me with like, catch a ride up above it, you know, all cool, right? I'm looking all badass for you to put some badass pictures of you with your car and your hat and all that. Hi, Scooter, right? Everything going okay? <laughs> I was, uh, I was just gonna... You know, go grab the paperwork, let me take care of that. Okay, bye. Alright, man, here's my standard endorsement contract. Don't mind the sub clauses about uh, explosions and whatnot. I might have copied it from Torg. Anyway, I figure as long as I'm in there and you're yeah, doing it for free, maybe you want to splurge and get some of the special packages. I got some good ones. I know it's a big decision. You go ahead and take your time. A lot of good choices, I know, I know. Real classy ones too. 
Sometimes I just stand here and, and stare at them, you know? I know how it is. That one would look badass as hell, man! Take it from me! That is some fine taste, man! Like a treat for yourself and for me getting to do it! Can't wait! Come on in, man! We'll get her all hooked up and get to work! Oh, crap. This doesn't look good. Hey, fellas, what can I do you for? Anna. I just hope that little deal you two struck is enough to get him to look the other way. Scooter won't turn us in. You don't know that. We don't even know what the reward is this time. You just gotta have some faith, Sasha. Out of teach him. Hope you ladies weren't too scared. Just doing my duty to keep ruffians the crap out of my garage. I'm a real protector type. Just all part of the service when you catch a r <coughs> Excuse me. Who were those guys? Man, just some wannabe tough guys trying to shake down a local business owner. You know how it is. Yeah, they looked pretty dangerous to me. <sighs> yeah, they probably could have killed me, but I look death in the face a lot. Like all the time. Like, hey Death, how you doing? No big deal. Seems like there's some bad men looking for you two, though. You got a place to lay low on getting your ride all fixed up? No. I say we hit the safe house. It'll have everything we need. Money, gear, new IDs. I remember when Felix first showed us that place. <laughs> Filthy rat hole. Felix is gone, but that stuff should still all be there. And maybe we can get some answers. Yeah, I think we can figure something out. Thanks, Scoot. Anytime. And I really mean that. I'm gonna go get started, okay? We shouldn't hang around here too long. Looks like he had company while he was away. Hopefully they didn't find the stash. Come on, look around. We gotta be in and out. Yeah. I got the door. If it's all the same to you, I could do without Felix's classical music right now. I had to force this on him once his eyesight was starting to go. Yeah, stubborn as always. I couldn't even get him to stop using floppy disks. Who is she? I don't know. They look happy, though. Felix's favorite chair. Those few times he felt he could relax anyways. A comfort directly proportional to its wear.
Piasses? Too many memories in this place. Let's hope there's a bit more than that. Find anything yet? Zilch. There's gotta be something, though. Let's keep looking. We better keep at it. Yeah, I'll let you know if I find anything. Always nice to see an old friend. Great, a flashlight. Maybe if we go camping. It's a black light. It's the one Felix used to check our first counterfeit bills. Oh, it looked familiar. It's hard to believe that asshole would be sentimental enough to keep this in his safe. Not unless he meant for us to find it. Sasha, look at this. What the hell? It's ultraviolet paint. I guess he wanted to keep all this a secret. Well, he left this for us to find, so... There's something he wanted us to see. There we go. He left something for us to find. Just like him to make a children's game out of something like this. He never could see us as adults. Well, maybe that was the problem. I see it! Right there! Awesome! Uh, if you find another flashlight under there, I'm leaving. Guess... That's what we're searching for, huh? Guess so. Here we go. Better double check the contents. Oh, hello, sexy. You're coming with me. What is it? It's an echo call. Why is there... If you're seeing this, I suppose I'm either dead or worse. My plan worked. I'm sorry. Fiona, Sasha, there's so much I want to tell you, but the less you know, the better. Oh, give me a break. Halfway through the con, I realized we were messing with Valerie's people. I knew that, and I never revealed it to you two. Well, if you're watching this, it won't be long before she's coming after you. Change your names. Change your appearance. Change your life. Valerie? Take Do you know you that name? And go. <laughs> forget about the life you had, and forget about me, but know that I love you both. With all my heart. Uh. <sighs> 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 
You know, it's okay to be mad, Sasha. Good! Because I am! I'm not gonna listen to another second of his bullshit! I can't believe you let him live! To be fair, I did shoot him. I wish I had that chance. I wish you hadn't shot him! Really? I wanted to take him out myself. It was always about the money. The second a big score showed up, he betrayed us. We had it. We had it in our hands, Fiona. Ten million dollars. Enough to get off this planet, enough to... to buy a new life. First, we find this vault. Take all the riches it contains, then we'll get off this rock. I promise you, one of these days you'll be looking down on Pandora from space. I'm gonna hold you to that. You always do. You want a sandwich? It might be a while before we eat again. Sure. What is it? It's some sort of an upgrade. Still only holds a single shot, but it looks like it adds an elemental effect to the bullet. Looks like Felix was holding out. Well, at least he got it eventually. Good thing this comes with another shot. I used my last one on Felix. He left you something, too. I don't want it. Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure. You're not even a little curious? No. I'll just hold on to it for you. In case you change your mind. I won't. So stubborn. You really gonna turn down a dead man's final gift to him? Cold-blooded. <laughs> right. You should be ashamed of yourself. Hands up, both of you. What you making? Sandwich. Hmm. Why you got a pan going for a sandwich? I like an egg on it. Alright, that's valid. I like it when the yolk is ready. Nice hair. What's that supposed to mean? It means your hair is nice. I will shoot you in the face right now if you're talking Whoa, shit! Finch, calm down, man. Don't talk about his hair, alright? He's good. Ah! Uh-uh! Heard me going up. You see me looking at you. Make him shoot through that nice floor. And for what? For nothing. You two got every bounty hunter in Pandora looking for you, and you're making a sandwich? Tie her up. Let's get out of here. Ooh! She's fast. Please. You embarrassing yourself. Go on. Fiona, shoot him! Do it. You're pointing that at a dude who has people shoot him in the chest for fun. I'm usually drunk. Charge 40 bucks. Uh, 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 uh.
You all right, man? Oh, yeah. Re real good. <laughs> Look, you don't have to be a tough guy about it. It's cool. <laughs> Hey, man. Hey! Go! Oh, I'm out with these bullets. And they come in. It's my story. Shut up. Is she still back there? I can't see her. Are you sure? Maybe she's on the rooftops. She could be anywhere. I can't... Ah, look out! Sasha! Oh, 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 oh. This ends now! Some stupid Hyperion Loaderbots gonna... Wait, that doesn't sound right. Loaderbots can't do Look, that. Look, were you there? No, you weren't. That's what happened. Go on. Was she bothering you? Yeah, you probably should have asked that before you threw her halfway across town. Oh, man. Did you see the look on her face? Oh, Athena's gonna be so pissed. Where's Reese and Vaughn? Scooter's Garage. They sent me to get you. Oh, well, that's nice of them. What? It is. Come with me if you want to leave. I told you Hyperion some bitches want back oh whoa 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 whoa! i promise that's our ride like hell man i know the woman that dropped this van off and you sure as crap ain't them well okay not our ride but being hyperion was your strike one man now you're lying to me in my garage that's like four or five more strikes right there are you guys trying to steal our van again ha i knew it oh my god can you please explain to this guy that we're friends no way these girls are associated with no Hyperion D-bags! Oh, okay, come on. We're not douchebags. I know. You're dick bags. Friends is a little much. I'd call it what it is. Which is? A temporary alliance. Well, that really hits the heart. I appreciate that, Fiona. These are my temporary allies. Can I get in the damn van, please? Ah, uh, well, if you say they're with you, I guess I can believe that, man. 
But if you ladies get into trouble, you just call, right? Or you know, you don't have to be in trouble to call, man. You just want to chit chat, or you find a restaurant you really like, or you know, wait, but, but the trouble thing, that's you, that's you. Scooter, you are awesome. This is incredible. You do amazing work. Oh yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Be sure to stop off at any of my catch a rides if you need anything. I got them popping up all over Pandora. No more bandits. Bandits. Eh, they haven't lived here for years. The Crimson Lance massacred them. Some say their corpses still roam the streets seeking vengeance. Sasha. Not to be a downer, but I'm not seeing any Atlas facility. I'm mostly seeing dry trash. Would it be so hard for just once something to go according to plan? Enough of this standing around crap. Let's get moving. Alright guys, sure it's not a fancy resort town, but we're not here for a day at the spa. We're looking for a top secret military facility. Don't worry, we'll figure this out. Pretty sure I can figure this out. We're on to something. Hey guys, guys, come check this out. It's like the whole grid leads right to here. I mean, with all these power lines everywhere, they've, they've got to be connected to something, right? It's different between here and here. Okay, let's see what that does. All right, now we're on to something. Oh, 
Oh, couldn't have left me a ladder, could you? Typical Atlas. Hey, guys. Hey. So, what did happen back there with, um... You know, the... Why do you ask? No. Sorry, it's... It's, it's none of my business. He got greedy. That's all there is to it. That's a nice sock. No, really? I mean, because, you know, a, a good pair of socks is an often overlooked detail of a gentleman's wardrobe. I'll try and remember that. Yeah, so... You want your boot back? I would love my boot back, yes. Don't say I never gave you anything. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. All right. Well, um, I'm gonna get back to it. We'll be here. something. Two.
secret entrance there the whole time? And that must be our facility. Underground hidden doors! Ha! <laughs> Atlas, man. So what's next? Well, clearly we go in. Whoa, whoa, easy! Watch where you point that thing. This is incredible. Pristine, preserved Atlas architecture. Yeah! And it's the real classy corporate stuff, not that military garbage you usually see. I'm with you, boys. This looks good. How about we find out if the inside's even better? No, 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 no. We're going in cool right now, okay? Remember? Remember we talked about cool? So cool. Looks like we're in the right place. Well, that's ominous. This is a massacre. Crimson Lance, these guys are serious badasses. Watch your step. Whole place could be booby-trapped. If this place is as valuable as we think it is, they might be trying to protect it. I don't see any signs of sensors or tripwires or anything like that. But still, you might be right. What the hell did this? Not what. Who? This is Athena's handiwork. Starting to think we might have just gotten lucky with her back there. Favorite Hyperion Mystery Man. Decent bond for your little playmates, right? It's very good to meet the two of you. It's a shame we couldn't be meeting under different circumstances. Bond? Reese? You didn't think I'd have August handling all my dirty work, did you? There are some things a man just does himself. Oh, what? Loaderbot, attack! I'm helping! Uh-uh-uh! Come on, guys. You didn't think I'd come all the way down here before grabbing a universal remote, did you? What? The Gordis Project, the two halves of the core, everything leading to a vault. We got it all. Checkmate, amigos. I am shame. What you think, Reese? That you can pilfer something from my toy box, no strings attached? You never could follow through. That's your problem. And that's why I beat you every time. Oh, your payback's coming, asshole. I don't know how, I don't know when, but you're gonna make a mistake. And when you do, <laughs> I'll be there. Sure, sure, I'll, uh, bring flowers. Yeah, you'll bring foot- wait, flowers? What? <gasps> to your grave, because you'll be dead. Oh, you guys will not believe the dream I just had. Holy crap. Wait, 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 what, what, what the hell is this? Didn't I just do this with this guy? Kill. I admire your consistency, but, uh, God. Oh, and who is this princess? Wait, they- <laughs> Son of a- Shock other people. Oh, yes, I knew about that. Um, don't touch the cores, I guess. Thanks for the heads up. Jackass. They're gonna have to do it for us. You'll cooperate, right? Because I figure if you don't, well, I... I can think of all sorts of things to do to your little friends. 
It'll make digging your own graves look like a day at the beach. We don't even know how these cores work. Yeah! We barely even know what this Gordas thing is! Fair. I vote we figure it out all together. Two hallways, two halves. I'll, uh, take my soon-to-be-dead janitor here. You take Miss Fancy Hat down the other one. Boys, you keep an eye on these two. Especially this one. Don't believe a thing she says. Oh, how sweet. Yeah, you sit tight. Get your hands off me! Either of those two move, you shoot them where they stand. Race, I'll admit it, you and uh, Vaughn have impressed me. And that sort of thing doesn't happen often. I'm surprised you've made it this far. I got Hugo Vasquez, Hugo Vasquez. There's, there's something I remember about this guy. What the hell really? is it? Really? It's unbelievable. You must have had some sort of help. Couple of death jockeys like you. I'd say it was 50-50 you'd survive the landing. Much less get as far as you have. Uh, My friends are out there. Okay, they're the reason. We actually... Oh, we actually make a good team. Oh, that's sweet. And now you're all gonna die together. <laughs> I guess so. Bummer. Just when you were making friends. I mean, you might think of me as a self-made man, and for the most part you'd be right. But there was this time when I looked up and admired one man in particular. The most impressive person He's I've gonna ever say known. me. Handsome Jack. You idiots always say me. Still can't figure out who he is, though. We had the special report. He would do this thing where he would punch me in the face whenever he'd see me. It didn't matter if he was busy. He always made time for me. No, still nothing. I, I punched my mom, for Christ's sake. Just boom, right in the kisser. I was drinking from a mug when he got me one time. I hate to break it to you, Vasquez, but what... You're describing you don't get is... it. You, you don't get it. You don't. The point is, I was his punching bag. Oh, man. He thought we were exclusive. That's adorable. I miss our time together. Ah, this drives me crazy. It's right there. It's on its own. But through me, his legacy carries on. Why don't you get paired up with an asshole like Vasquez? No, he's not so bad. He's just a little dumb. Valerie, the woman I work for, she's got a lot of contacts up on Hyperion, Vasquez being one of them. Problem is, we tried to cut her out of the deal. Hmm. Obviously, that was a bad idea for a lot of reasons. The fact that the vault key was bullshit being first and foremost. Well, Valerie found out about it, so now we've got to convince her that whatever comes out of this room is worth more than the $10 million deal we tried to slip under her nose. Then, hopefully, she doesn't kill us all. She ever talk about me? What? Sasha, did she ever talk about me? You guys are sisters. I figure you'd talk every now and again. Oh yeah, all the time. Really? <laughs> no, she can't stop talking about how much of a moron you are. You're funny. Look, I just want you to know, as far as you and I are concerned, there's no hard feelings. That is so generous of you. I'll think about that when you shoot me in the back. Come on, don't be like that. You're the one that hustled me, remember? And that, you see, is what I was trying to provide for you. Some guidance, some mentorship. A father figure. I was trying to help you. The janitor gig, it was to test your metal, your resolve. And I gotta say, you reacted with some balls, kid. Some big old balls. You see, Reese, I started at the bottom, and I worked my way up. I, uh... <laughs> I used to be in the mailroom. Whoa, wait a minute! Wallet head! That's where Jack found <laughs> He used to be bald and he was going through these hair implants and, and, and 
I it would stick money to his head. It was, <laughs> oh my it was hilarious. Oh, that was a long time ago. A ask him about it. He'll tell you. Ask him about it. <laughs> go on. Go on, seriously. But that's ask a him. pretty big difference. Hey, hey, c come on. I'm, I'm handing it comedy gold here. You, 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 what, are you going to ignore this? Listen, uh, wallet head. Wallet head? <laughs> yeah, so... I appreciate the advice. I, I, I do. But I'd much rather you take your two cents and shove them into your wallet that you have on the back of your head that you are ashamed of because you are a wallet head. I... I was trying to be nice to you. <laughs> Let's get this over with. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's I take your corpse thing. back up to Helios, I'm gonna make sure they save me some of your skin to make a wall out of. Whenever I see it, I'll remember the look on your face at this moment. Whoa. That's... legitimately creepy. I can't tell you how much I... No! Hey! Hey! I just... I just need some reassurances. That it was just about the money and nothing else. The relationships have to be built on trust. I don't know if I can take Sasha back without it. How do you even start a conversation like that? At this point, I assume she's just embarrassed. You two should just talk. Clear the air, see where it gets you. Yeah, we should do that. Well, here we are. Go on, stalling won't do you any good. Come on, are you stalling? chat? <laughs> I can't imagine he's too happy with you guys. Uh, at least that's the vibe I was getting. I hate that son of a bitch. I kind of picked up on that. Gortis unit ready for assembly. We got it! We got it! That's our cue.
was that? That is a metal ball. How's this gonna get us into a vault? That's the only leverage we've got at this point. Meaning? Right. You've got one bargaining chip to work with. Okay! Just grab the thing and let's go. No, 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 what are you doing? Warning. Gorgeous device compromised. Smooth one, idiot. Subsystems, man. I can hack into these drones and I can uh, uh, almost guarantee no one dies. Unless you want them to. Probably. Uh, just let me in. I... Come on! It's under control, Trust me. What? No, no. Listen, we can take over the whole facility, kid. We got this. I'll do it. Back away. You shouldn't even have a plan. Okay, what? Are you talking to me? Yes, yes, I'm talking to you. Do whatever it is you have to do. <laughs> How are you doing that? I'm not. Really. <laughs> 